I mean, I'm not blowing smoke up your ass. You look fucking fantastic. Well, and, thank you. And, you know, you've never made a secret about, you know, you'll do pla- you'll take a nip and a tuck here and there. So many people screw that up. If I was going to do something to myself, I would go to your doctors. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> do people call you all the time and say, Dolly, how do you do it? Oh, yeah. And I always say, just find the best doctors. I even, some of my celebrity friends, I give them the names of my of the doctors that I've I've used, but you just got to be very careful not to overdo it because you never know. Anytime you go under the knife, you could come out looking not good. Uh, oh, just like yeah. when, when Kenny had, you know, when Kenny Rogers, especially harder for men because you can't wear the makeup and all the different eyelashes and stuff. But I mean, even, and that was one of the best doctors. You just never know how you're going to heal. You never know what's going to go. So you absolutely need to find the best doctors, the most talked about doctors are the ones highly recommended. If you're going to do anything to, about your face, you can cover up stuff if somebody screws up things on your body. But boy, if you live with your face out there, you got to be careful. So I try to do just little bits at a time. I, I don't do like, you know, really big stuff. And then I, I do a lot of, I do fillers, Botox and Juvederm or whatever, you know, just the fillers and just only when I have to, you yeah. know, do something. And even then I try to be, be careful. I've gone to several doctors. They tell me there's no fixing my face. They can't do it. It's <laughs> well, just impossible. Well, you're beautiful you... as you are. Nobody <laughs> yeah. wants to change you. <laughs> but you know what, Dolly, you're right about Kenny Rogers. They always a good looking man. Very. He should have left it alone. He should have well, left Well, but it you alone. know what? He probably just, you know, like how we all get that sagging, dragging, bagging thing. You know, like if you're under your eyes, you know, you think, well, I got to get these bags out. And somebody convinces you, <laughs> I know the best eye doctor. But you right. don't know how you're going to heal. And that's what's so hard about it. It can, it changes your expressions. Even yes. if the surgery itself is good, it changes your personality. It can. Did so, you ever talk uh, to Kenny about it? Did you ever? Because you were close. Yeah, they, I was they, very they, close to Kenny, and I, you know, because I made him feel better about it. In fact, the, one of the last times we was together, I mean, we were like brother and sister. We just said whatever, and I told him, I said, Kenny, I'm glad I got, I got to live long enough to see you grow into your facelift, you know. <laughs> so <laughs> he thought that was the funniest thing, but he did. You know, as he got older, you know, his skin, you know, started to loosen and. And he yeah. looked more, you know, more natural. But it's always a risk, and I'm always every time I go in for anything, I think, oh Lord, please, you know, let this all <laughs> it's work like out. It's like rolling fine. the dice. Yeah. 